Oh. Oh man, Earl's house. Earl's house. Okay, so this is my uh, my next door neighbor. And before I even explain this piece, I got to explain Earl. He is um, with, with without Earl, I I'm not sure where I would be. Earl was our next door neighbor for quite some time. The very first person outside of family and friends that trusted me to paint his house. And he would let me come in there and do what he wanted, do what I wanted. He would pay me a little bit of money. Early on, I told him, if you just buy the paint and let me come in and put the design up, you don't have to pay me. And so that was our relationship. But but without Earl, um, I, w without Earl, a lot of this wouldn't be possible. He's he's one of the integral steps on on in my journey. Uh, but for this bathroom, man, he wanted he wanted something something kind of fun in the bathroom. And I told him I had this idea of uh, putting some. Uh, I had this idea of of putting some some. Some, some shapes on the ceiling. So I put a bunch of squares and rectangles on the ceiling and it's a little half bathroom, so I call it the sky box. And the reason being is because there's just a bunch of boxes in the sky if you're just kind of looking up that way. Uh, but that was, that was the idea there and I, I, I love painting ceilings. I don't do a lot of them, uh, but it's because it's just a random place, man. People don't expect art to be on your roof and that's why I kind of love putting stuff on the ceiling so when people go into that half bath, they look up and oh, that's not what they were expecting. When the, the only thing with ceiling work is you're looking up constantly, your neck constantly feels broken. Another thing people don't even think about is I've had to start wearing like glasses or sunglasses if I'm doing ceiling work because the paint will drip into your face and I've literally come home with paint droplets on my eyeballs not having realized that they have dried on top of my contacts and Vera is like, bro, go, go change your contacts. Like you've got paint literally on your contacts. So uh, yeah, I, I do love painting ceilings. It is, it is, it's, it's literally neck breaking though.